Hi, this is Sammy W. with Math Help. Okay, so we have a problem. F of 0 equals negative 7. F of 7 equals 1. Write a linear function with the given values. I need help. We don't understand this level of math. Okay, so let's take a look at it. I know how you feel. So let's take a look at it. We're going to get to the bottom of this. Okay, so f of 0 equals negative 7, f of 7 equals 1. So, you know, y equals f of x. f of x, that means f of x equals a negative 7. So, when x is equal to 0, what we're saying, when x is equal to 0, f of x equals negative 7. We know y equals f of x. So that means when x equals 0, y equals a negative 7. So that gives us a point 0, comma, negative 7. So that's your ordered pair. Once we get this second ordered pair, we can find the slope. Well, same thing here. f of x, x, f of x, x. So f of x equals y when x equals 7, see we're replacing the 7 with the x with 7. When x equals 7, y equals 1. So now that gives us another point, 7, 1. Take your time, plug in these values. Don't get them confused or mixed up. We know that slope intercept form of the equation, y equals mx plus b, that's going to be the key here. We already have b because the point 0, negative 7 is our y-intercept b. So we have that. We have that all we need is m. Once we find m, we can set up our general equation. Find m this way, 8 sevenths. So you really couldn't have guessed that. 8 sevenths, you had to be able to work it out. Well, by working it out, 8 sevenths x minus b, okay, plus b, but in this case, it's minus, minus 7. So I back check this. You want to back check this up here. So when x equals 0, y equals negative 7, yes, that's our intercept. So, but when x equals, so that also satisfies the first value. When x equals 7, 7's cancel. 8 minus 7 gives us 1. So that does check out. So, yeah, that was a tricky, kind of a tricky question, the way it was worded. But, you know, what I saw was this. So you got to, it's just a, the teacher wants to know, a deeper understanding of whether you really understand what's going on. Does y equal f of x? So this is y, y of 0. That means y when x is 0. So y when x is 0, negative 7. That's the type of thought process that goes into it. Sometimes it's not going to be obvious, but you're going to have to take a look at it and just hack away at the problem. Hack away at it until you get it, step by step, until you get it. Hopefully that was helpful to you. I'm always here to help. Thank you very much.